Hey YouTube, how's it going? Hey, there's my dad. What up? You can't hear him. We'll figure out this dual vlog thing eventually. So we're gonna go for a ride. You're welcome to come along. You're not gonna be able to hear dad, but that's what it is for now. Hey, that's all right. That's all right. All right, see you on the road. No, it's not bad for me. Yeah, I don't. Yeah. Uh, you must type your mic in a good spot. I don't hear any wind noise. Harley called me on, or sent me a, a message on my um, messenger, my Facebook messenger. They were wanting me to come up next weekend and do some demo rides for them, lead some groups out and stuff. Yeah, they were gonna give me a hundred bucks and in store credit, but I've got a wedding that day. So, gotta pass on that one. I told them to make sure that they reach out to me next time. Are you taking the left or the right side? Take the left then. to get up to like what, 79 or 80 degrees a day. I gotta say, you look good on that new bike. It fits your body well. Yeah, it does. Yeah, that last one is just too small for you. That Sportster. That one, that one looks real good on you. Yeah, I bet. bikes on today. Yes it is. I've got your Glock 19 on today. It feels real nice. Yeah, it's a lot better than that 22 that I have. Yeah, it's not as heavy. Thanks for letting me borrow that. 38. What one do you got on? Uh, oh, the revolver? Yeah. Yeah. I didn't realize that you were carrying, so it fits you well. Oh, yeah? Nice. I don't know if I'd want to carry a firearm inside my vest. Well, with a semi automatic, I'd be afraid I'd depress the trigger. So it's like it's a revolver, you don't really have that. It takes a little more squeeze, doesn't it? Well, last summer I put in this easy pull on my clutch. Man, that's butter smooth now. All right. 
<laughs> Been a while. <laughs> I think you've killed it before. Yeah. get to Lafayette when I look at my gas. I got I got enough for the ride, but before we come home I'll need to get some. Oh yeah I've not filled up yet this season. Oh let's see I've got uh, 77 left so I'm I'm enough but yeah, I got over 5,000 miles on this bike now. I'm at 5,085. Yeah, that's not bad. Pretty soon you'll need to get your first service. Are you going to go to Harley for your first service, or are you going to go somewhere else? The first one at least? Yeah. That's, yeah, that's what I did. I tell you what. Dan over at Red Hot Chop Red Hot Choppers. He does a great job with servicing. But yeah, if you want to go to your first one with Harley, I'd understand that one. Just to make sure everything's happy. My 5000 service, he did mine and he did a good job with it. gonna get tired of me saying it feels good but man this feels good <laughs> they're gonna have to deal with it <laughs> there's nothing like being on your own bike I've done a couple of test rides this year man you get back on your own bike where it's comfortable your bars are set up the way you want it your foot controls are the way you want it man it's just I don't have any intention of getting rid of Betty for a long time. Yeah, I'm, I'm really happy. There's nothing really I'm wanting to do to her now. I'm about done. Yeah, I'm, there's nothing really after her at all. Just uh, sit back and enjoy her now. Now, you got Bell knocked out pretty good. Yeah, because you don't care how loud it is. You just want it to sound nice. So, yeah, those pipes will be great for you. Uh, you got the we got some nice slip-ons. Yeah. New gloves the last time I was in Indy. Yeah, I, from, I went to Har the new Harley one in Plainfield. Or no, not Plainfield. Uh, what city is that they moved to? They were in Indy and now they're in, oh, Fishers. They're in Fishers now, yeah. It's a nice building. But yeah, I remember last year I my gloves fell off the, the bridge to the Raccoon River, Raccoon Lake. So I had to get some new ones. These ones are pretty nice. I like them. solid leather ones but in the summertime those would get pretty hot so I wanted some ones that had a little more vent to them uh, well yeah you get used to 
that. Getting a neutral. Yeah, I don't have that problem. Well, some people do, I guess. Just foot control, I guess. Yeah, different bike. So you'll get more time riding it this year. Last year you didn't get a lot of chance to ride. So you'll get used to it. And you're still my riding buddy, right? You're still my riding buddy. I need someone to go out with. Alright then. No calling it quits for you for a while. That's right. So are you done with your chemo stuff now? End of the year. But you're cleared for any more bad cells? You're doing good? Okay. But it's a, how often are you doing chemo now? Because you're not you're past the hard stage. Every eight weeks? What's that every two months? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Last treatment in December. There you go. my appointment to get my Harley tattoo finished. Yep. It's about three quarters of the way done right now. So I go June 19th to get it finished up. About another month from now I guess. on the banks and stuff, but uh, I'd rather be on the land. to figure out this dual vlog thing where people can hear you. I wonder if I can take your GoPro footage and just run the video or just run the audio on top of my video. I bet I can. Are, are you recording right now? No? Oh geez. We could have had an epic episode right here, talking about all kinds of stuff, and you don't even turn your GoPro on. Oh man, Dad. <laughs> That's all right. Yeah. I'll probably only post the up there because otherwise it turns into an hour and a half video. So.
But anyway, the next time that we run our GoPros at the same time, <laughs> I think I can maybe put yours on mine and just, because the, the editing software I use, I can turn off the video and keep the audio. So I think I can probably run your audio and my video with my audio too. So I'll figure that out, I guess. I'm just not real creative when it comes to editing and making inserts and things. But people seem to like my videos. Yeah, I have over a thousand subscribers now. It's like super awesome. People seem to like to watch me ride, I guess. my wife that we're probably going to go to Lafayette. We're gone most of the day, maybe. And she said she was cool with it. She, said she didn't have any plans. Yeah, yeah, she's really cool about letting me get out and be myself. Even if she doesn't want anything to do with the motorcycle. Yeah. yeah she's, she's really cool like that. I got a good wife. She put it up with me. Yeah. Alright, come on. You don't have to yell. I can hear you. <laughs> yep. All right. Sun beating down something else. Yeah. Don't yell, please. <laughs> no, I don't, but I need to.
going to the speed limit on this road. Your um, 2018 sticker for your license plate makes your O look like a U. The pup two. <laughs> It is supposed to be an O, right? Oh, okay, yeah. It doesn't look like one. You run over that thing? Oh. Yeah. It's not cold, cloud, cold windy, it's a north, a north, <laughs> warm wind. Yeah. Yeah, it does feel good. I'm right into a dip. <laughs> I am. My feet are. Well, I think this doesn't shake, does it? Mine's like all shaking around and. Yeah. I can tell it's pretty solid.
we go. Trying to get some good footage of you riding. That way I can have a new picture of you. time flower time YouTube. Hope you liked me and Dad's uh, ride out to Harley. Thanks for watching. Deuces. I don't think so. No, I think they're just people. And we'll perk up in there like we always do.